it is Thursday, therefore you get to see me. For me, Thursdays are good because I'm here and I really enjoy making videos and being a part of this channel in case you guys didn't know that. <laughs> it makes me happy. The topics for this week are abusive relationships, what to do if someone you know is in them, etc. Uh, and <clears throat> how to let someone down if you have lost interest in them, like before you start dating them and you just kind of decide it's not what you, uh, what you want, I suppose. Uh, so, I took some time to think about the second one. Don't say, it's not you, it's me. It's cliche and it's like frustrating for all involved because it doesn't really tell them anything and I just think that you know, if that's how you feel, that it's, you know, it's not them, it's you, then that's fine. But you should at least give them, like, full sentences and e explanation of how you're feeling and, and why, what it is about you and what it isn't about them. Just, just saying. Also, if possible, I, I think that it's best to do it in person. Um, I understand that sometimes you might be, you know, talking to somebody online, like we talked about online relationships last week. And... If that's the case, then of course you can't do it in person. You're not going to fly all the way out there just to say, hey, I'm not interested. That would just be stupid. Um, and probably misleading, because they'd be like, yay, she's coming to see me. And then you'd be like, no, I just came to tell you that I'm not interested. Just make sure that you're gentle and genuine. Um, and be aware that, that the person that you're talking to, like, she might feel a little hurt by the fact that you're saying that you're not interested if she like especially if she's still interested in you there's nothing you can do about that but there is you know a way to kind of protect her feelings the best you can um and if you care in any like in any way shape or form for the feelings of another human being then you know you should try to be uh polite and i just thought of like a couple things that uh you could say that might be an option for you if you're if you're in this situation. Uh, the, the first was, um, you know, hey, there's, there's like, it's definitely nothing wrong with you, like, and we're a great match in a lot of ways, and maybe you say, you know, hey, you're, well, you're smart, you're fun, you're attractive, you know, list a couple good things about that person, and then just say, you know, but for whatever reason, like, I don't really feel strongly enough about this, and I know that it's important for me to have a strong connection by now, like, we've known each other for a little while, and, and if it hasn't happened yet, then, then, I'm just thinking that maybe this isn't right for me. Um, and you could also say, uh, I really struggle with this decision because I like you and I don't want to hurt you. Uh, I didn't make the decision lightly, but I just feel that it's the right thing. Uh, and then maybe you could offer, like, you know, just say, hey, but like, like, does that make sense to you? Like, do you, like, is there anything that, like, you're confused about or, like, how do you feel? Maybe just give them a chance to ask you a question or two if they're, you know, maybe you guys haven't known each other that long, but in the, you know, short time you've known each other, there was, like, something that happened, and they and they think that it has something to do with that, and they say, hey, does this have to do with the other night? And you can at least clarify that, no, this isn't about that. It's just, you know, how I'm feeling. Um, so just kind of leave it open and let them know that you're not just saying, all right, you know, peace out, I'm done. Um, so don't be a dick about it. Just <laughs> be, uh, be thoughtful. Imagine that if it was you in that situation and what you would, um, what you would like for someone to, you know, to say to you, or at least, you know, how you would like them to take care of your feelings and, you know, be thoughtful and not just be harsh and say, like, yeah, I'm not really interested anymore. Kick rocks. That's, that's not what you want to do. So. Okay, so I guess that's all I have to say for today, and I suppose I will see you next Thursday.